Now we are going to talk about deadlifts. A uh, barbell deadlift is different setup than the kettlebell setup. Uh, with a barbell, your shins get in the way of the really long bar. That doesn't happen with the kettlebell, so we will set up differently. The way you will set up is you will stand so that your ankles are on the sides of the handle. And if you look straight down, you shouldn't be able to see the kettlebell. If you are struggling to find your perfect setup position, one thing that you can do is take some yoga blocks or a half foam roll and you'll put them at about your toe line. And when you're doing your deadlift, if you hit into them or you knock them down at all, then you know you came too far forward. And in that case, you're just doing a squat. So you will hinge at the hip, press the butt back, grab your bell, lock your shoulder blades into place, tuck your chin in to protect your neck, drive through your heels and stand. And then as you go down, the first thing to happen is your butt goes back and the bell should end in the same position that it started. And again, and down. If you don't have yoga blocks or you only have a whole kettle or a whole foam roller, what you can do is get in your start position and put the foam roller right at the tip of your head. That way you'll be knocking your head into the foam roller if you lose position and that will be a cue. You can also do this facing the wall if you have neither a foam roller or blocks. 